It seems that since this console generation started, all we've been expecting from Big Dog publishers is remasters. One remaster people were asking for was Modern Warfare. Well folks, Activision want all the money, and here we have it, a remaster of Modern Warfare. Not much has changed to the core of Modern Warfare. If anything at all, all this does is show us just how far we haven't come from the game that was released a decade ago. The developers at Raven Software, they did the port, were quick to let us know that they didn't want to tweak a lot of things as it would ruin the flow of the original game. There's been a nice new look of paint plastered on top of Modern Warfare though, and it brings it up to par with what we'd expect from today's shooty bang bangs. And don't get me wrong, it looks nice. Really nice. The main thing I'd want you, the viewer, to take away from Modern Warfare Remastered is, if you haven't played this game, you need to. The campaign and multiplayer suite is an enhanced version of the greatest military shooter I've ever played, with arguably the most memorable mission in military shooter history. Yes, that one. The multiplayer defined an entire last generation, and it brought about Call of Duty's rise to power. It ensured Modern Warfare 2 was made, and the rest is pretty much history. Its powerful moment-to-moment -moment arcade shooting is the reason that the franchise is still lining the pockets of Activision today. And even with lashings of hate around its new current project, Infinite Warfare, it's still going to make millions. One of the big reasons behind that is the exceptional video game experience that comes bundled with the special editions. It hits the nostalgia button really hard, and along with Halo 3, they were my ramps onto the shooter genre. It's when I stopped playing kids games and hugging my Nintendo, I realised what adult gaming really looked like. Which is kind of ironic now, because the franchise's online modes are played by snivelling snot monkeys called I Just Bummed Your Mum 69 420 for days. I digress. Anyone who played Modern Warfare in its original state will not be unhappy in picking up this game. It gets everything right that it needs to. It looks and feels like how your brain remembers Modern Warfare, and it makes minor improvements to the UI and soundscape, all whilst maintaining both the good things and the bad from the original. Three grenades, death streaks, noob tubing, they're all present. And whilst you know you hate all of those things, you're going to use them anyway.